doing a shirt that I got off kitgg4.com and it is the brand new Aston Villa home shirt for the 23-24 season so let's go for a look around this one got some colour nice colour there like that go around Nice line there on the, on the sleeve, nice. Under there, good. Around there, good. Go down the hem at the side. I like it. Hem at the bottom. Nice. Hem up here. Nice. Good, 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 good. Well, stitching at the moment, kit GG4. You've not let me down with the other shit that I've had. Here are the badges, and there is that new Aston Villa badge, which is a take on the 80 badge that they had. The one just that line's been flipped because he faced that way on the original. But I like that. I like that. I like, I like that better than the the uh, last season's badge. Yeah, it looks a little bit off to one side to me there. Or is it just the way it's been? It hangs. It might just be. But that's been embroidered. Done really nice. The castore. Probably that's not right because um, on most castore shirts it is sewn in. That's been heat pressed on, but it's done really nice. He's the kit sponsor, which everyone's been saying that they don't like. Maybe if that was in claret, it would look good. Or maybe put that in white, it would look better. But I don't mind it, I like it better than kazoo. That looked a bit in your, in your face. Here we have our sleeve sponsor, and it's Trade Nation. And that has been heat pressed on and done nicely. It's a bit creased there where it's been in the packaging. Here's our Castoria there with a number on it, which will be probably on every Castoria shirt. <laughs> and that's been heat pressed on. So done nicely. Uh, and, we, and at the end of the video, we'll go on about this pattern. So let's just do an overview of the front. And let's turn it round and see what it's like round there. Right, here we are at the back of the shirt. Let's start at the bottom this time. So we've got two hems here. So we've got two, both hems. I like that. I like the way they've done that. Nice. Nicely well done. Uh, Villa and Castore. I like that. Around the shoulder and the sleeve part again. There's that claret line going through the light blue. I like that. Collar line, good, good. Clamp line again, good. Down to there, good, good. Really nice. I'm have another collar, another bit of stitching here, which actually looks decent. Actually, it actually looks fairly round. Not like some of them where they're odd, like odd shaped. And on the back is when we have a the Villa Lion. See, it faced that way on the original badge, where now it's facing that way. And that's been heat pressed on, done nicely. Why didn't Manchester United put that on their new home shirt? It would look smashing. And once again, we have that pattern on, which we'll speak about at the end of the video. So there's a quick overview. Let's turn it inside out and see what it's hiding in there. Right, here we are on the inside. All right, collar line again. Bit of a bunched up bit of thread there. But nothing major, just needs cutting off or leave it because it's nothing, is it? Stitch in there, good. Under there, good. Round there, good. Go down this part again. At the bottom. 
good. Bottom hem, nice. Bit of loose stitch in there, but just chop that off. Nothing major. Here we have our usual Castore made in Thailand washing instructions label. Remember, hand wash or turn inside out, hand wash, put a very gentle setting on your washer, and these shirts should last a long time. Up here. Good. Bit of a bit of a loose bit of thread there and mist of, the mist of material. Nothing is it. And there, and there. Well, I can let this off the inside, it's really good. Right, let's have a look at these badges. Castore being heat pressed on, you can see it, but you can't see nothing else. The villa badge has three bits and one bit of paper, which is spot on. And the sponsor, you can see it, so it must be like material. And on here we have our mandatory Better Never Stops Castore 2XL tag, which is a generic tag that they put on all Castore shirts. Right, do we overview? Let's turn it over and see what it's like around there. Right, here we are on the other side. Right, start up at the bottom again with this dual stitching. Nice. Nice. Up to here. I mean, I'm, not, I'm actually looking for loose thread near, so I'm well impressed. Around here. Go down here. We'll look at that castore in a minute on the collar. Down here, down to there. Well, no loose stitching. Excellent. And there we go, we have that. And let's see if we've got it. Castore, Castore, C. Si. You couldn't do it, could you? And also a bit of loose threading, but is that just. Oh, it's just a bit of uh, loose stitching. <laughs> there we have our Castore, which we've seen in all these. Shirts made by this manufacturer, Castore 2XL, so it should fit nicely. Right, do an overview. Let's turn it inside out again and do my final thoughts and wrap up this video. Right, we are back at the front again. Right, material. This is uh, the good thing about this shirt. As we can see here, we've got, I know it's exactly the same material, and I've looked at it, it's just obviously there's been. Uh, a light blue and this being claret you couldn't really see but yeah it's the same type of material nice and breathable it was supposed to be the play spec version I'm sure that's what this was I'll have to look on them um, the uh, purchase and um, details on kick GD for right um, right things about this shirt and um, this pattern um, there's a tune, well, the song that the fans sing in um, Villa Park, and this is supposed to be the lyrics to that song, well, tune or what the fans sing. Um, I don't know how you get that from, from off here, personally, but uh, that's where it's supposed to be, and I like that. Something good, something for the fans. Um, another thing about this shirt, um, I like this new badge. I really do. Like I say, it's, it's, a, it's a retro modern badge which I like. I like it, I like, I like it when uh, teams do that, where they don't keep the same old uh, badge every season. They change it and make it better. Um, and other things about the shirt, like I, said, I just like the design of it. <laughs> Something when I've seen it uh, advertised when uh, it was uh, on football shirt culture. I've just seen it and I thought, yeah, that is being put in my basket. And Kit GG was the only one selling it. So, Kit GG4, I'm impressed. Excellent quality. Absolutely spot on. Can't fault this. Um, delivery wise was a bit long. About 25 days. Maybe 20 from saying it had been dispatched, which is a bit long. 
but with quality you don't mind waiting um, for shirts like this um, so yeah so that's a, another Premier League shirt that I've done and another Castore that I've done and uh, so I hope you like this one if you have give me a big thumbs up uh, subscribe to my channel if you what if you view it subscribe cost you nothing just helps me my channel grow um, drop me a comment say what you think of this shirt see if there's any shirts that you want me to look at purchasing in the future and I'll be back with another shirt next time Bye-bye now.